Hi everybody, Patty Ann here. I'm sure you can hear my tea kettle when you're hoping I turn it off quickly. It's um, boiling hot water. And the reason why I'm doing this is to show you a little experiment. Remember that mug that I had done? I think it was back in Valentine's Day. I don't know. I'll put a link in the to that video below this so you can see it if you haven't. It's, it's a good one, I think. But anyway, I'm going to take this over here because that mug that I had made a long time ago, I had used just regular vinyl on it and regular Cricut vinyl. And people said, well, that won't stay in the dishwasher. And I washed it time and time and time again in my dishwasher. And look at that lettering. It's still on there perfectly. It's not moving at all. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pour bo boiling hot water on this today from my tea kettle. And you saw it boiling or heard it. You can see the steam coming off. And really, just get that hot, stop for a sec, let it sit for a second. Then I'm gonna take my finger and try to rub these letters off because people say, oh, it's so hot, I can't do it. People say they just slide right off, but look, they're not sliding off at all. Now, I'm gonna put some more hot water on here. So this is just a test that I'm doing because like I said, people thought maybe my dishwasher didn't get hot enough for my lettering to come off. So let me explain again what I did, and I'll have the link for the video below. I did wash the mug really well. It's a mug from Ikea, not that that matters. It's a ceramic mug. Maybe that's the point. Maybe some people are doing it on something other than ceramic. But anyway, I rinsed it off, and then I wiped it off really carefully with 91% um, alcohol, rubbing alcohol. And then I adhered these to it and burnished it on really well, as you'll see in that video. And then I waited 48 hours before I did anything to it. So this is months later, and oh, that is so hot. I can hardly do this, but those letters are stuck. They're not coming off. So this was just a follow-up. So remember, sometimes be careful. Um, you might want to test things yourself. So anyway, thanks for joining me, y'all. If you like my videos, give me a thumbs up. Hope to see you again soon. Bye.